What's up everyone, today I thought I'd bring you guys a video just talking about the new LEGO sets that LEGO has revealed, so make sure to follow me on Facebook and on Twitter. Let's get right into the video. In the past few days, LEGO has announced a bunch of new LEGO sets that will hit stores this year. I thought I needed to talk about them because a few of these sets I'm quite excited for. We'll start with one new Marvel set that they're going to be releasing. The biggest of all these sets is the Shield Helicarrier. It contains 2,996 pieces. This set includes five minifigures, Nick Fury, Black Widow, Captain America, Hawkeye, and Maria Hill, plus an iconic Shield Eagle stand to display them on. It also features three micro-scale Quinjets, three fighter jets, a gasoline truck, two forklift trucks, two runways, four road blockades, plus 12 micro figures, which include Nick Fury, Hawkeye, Captain America, Iron Man, and eight Shield agents. The inside of the helicarrier is very detailed and looks like a lot of time and effort was made into making this helicarrier look like it does in the movies. This didn't come from it, the toy fair, I just thought that I should talk about it because it looks amazing. The next sets I'm looking forward to are the Scooby Doo sets because I grew up watching Scooby Doo. They have released images for five sets. The first one is called the Headless Horseman. It includes a mystery van plane, Scooby, Shaggy, and the Headless Horseman. The next one is called the Mystery Mansion. It includes a huge spooky mansion, Scooby, Shaggy, Velma, Daphne, a vampire, a ghost, and a knight. The most iconic set of all is called the Mystery Machine. It includes the Mystery Van, a big tree, of course, Shaggy, Scooby, and Fred. This will probably be the first set that I'll buy because of course, like I said, it's the most iconic one of them all. The next one is called the Haunted Lighthouse. It includes a lighthouse, of course, Shaggy, Scooby, Daphne, Lighthouse Tower owner, I guess one of the bad guys, and then the other bad guy, which is the sea monster. The last one is the smallest of all the sets, and it's called the Mummy Mystery Museum. It includes a mummy's coffin, Shaggy, Scooby, and the evil mummy. So it looks like the most relevant figures are the ones you get all the time are Shaggy and Scooby, of course, because they're the main things that Scooby do. Scooby-Doo, Scooby Shaggy, my friends, so yeah. Now it's time to talk about the Jurassic Park sets. The biggest set is called the Indominus Rex Breakout. It includes an ACU trooper, a handler, a helicopter, four minifigures, a gyro ball, which is a plastic ball that fits a figurine within, and an amber with a mosquito. The next one is called the Pterodon Capture. It comes with a Jurassic 1 chopper, the Pterodon, and two minifigures. The next of the sets is called the Dilophosaurus Ambush, if that's how you say it. It includes a young boy, an ACU trooper, and a Dilophosaurus, and a Jeep, of course. The next one is called Raptor Rampage. It comes with three minifigures, two raptors, and a big truck with a turret on the top of it. This is one of the biggest sets. One of the bigger sets, I mean, and it's called the T-Rex Tracker. It features three minifigures, a T-Rex, and a truck with a cage that can hold the T-Rex. That is all of the Jurassic Park sets, so those one, two, three, four, five sets. I'm quite excited for them. A lot of them seem cool. The most expensive one is the Indominus Rex Breakout. It's 130 bucks in the States, so in Canada, when I'm going to get it, it's going to be around 150 So that is all of the sets that I thought were really cool. All of this information did come from the New York Toy Fair. They didn't just randomly release a bunch of sets out of the blue. They don't really usually do that, only for one or two here and there. The sources that I used for this video will be in the description down below. This didn't cover all the sets that they revealed, this just covered all the sets that I thought were really cool, and the ones that I will definitely be getting. So thanks for watching everyone, and I'll see you guys later.